Hello and welcome to the channel that is all about WordPress. This video is sponsored by AppMaker.xyz. Today we will learn how Yeet WooCommerce wishlist plugin can be set up within the WooCommerce based website. Before that, let me tell you about this plugin. This is one of the most powerful and popular tool in an e-commerce shop. From this, user can actually save their favorite products and can purchase them later. Can also share the wish list in the social networks. Also, user can share the wish list with their friends, families, and they can purchase the product later. Now, let's install and set up this plugin within the admin dashboard. Now, within the dashboard, we will go to plugins and add new section. Now, within the search plugin, we will provide the name. It will search accordingly. Now, as you can see, here is a Yeet WooCommerce wishlist plugin. For me, it is showing the activate button because I have already installed it. For you, it will show the install now button because you will be installing this plugin for the first time. Let's activate the plugin. Now, as you can see in the plugin list, Yeet WooCommerce wishlist plugin is active. Now we will go to settings page. Here you can see there are number of tabs with the options. In general settings, you can see there are two options like enable index loading and the other option, Yeet WooCommerce frequently bought together integration. For now, we will leave this option as it is and we'll move to next tab that is add to wishlist options. Now, in this tab, you can actually set up the look and feel of the add to wishlist button. Like here you can uh, set up the product page list settings like where you want to position the add to wishlist button. Uh, it says after add to cart. Now you can also customize the text of the add to wishlist. Accordingly, there are some options available. Similarly, you can perform the style and color customization of that wishlist button. For now, we leave this settings as it is and we move to the other tab. We are leaving the settings as it is because the required fields are already set as per requirement. Let's move to the next tab that is this list page option. Now in this tab you can set the wish list page by selecting the page from here and within that you have to add this particular short code. Also uh, in wish list page what details you want to show. So accordingly you can uh, select the data like I want to show the product price, I want to show the add to cart option and by default, there is the option selected, which is I can to remove the product from the business. Then there are other more options. Here you can see that it have the option for share on social media. You can select accordingly. Now, as we have selected some options, then we can go to the save button and save it. Now, Let's go to the front end of this website and we'll see how the wishlist functionality works. Now, here you can see there's a wishlist menu option. 
by default when you activate the yeet woocommerce wishlist plugin it will automatically create a wishlist page now within the wishlist uh, you can store the products that you want to purchase later so for that let's select a product suppose this now within the product detail page you can see there is a add to wishlist option we will click on to this option and you can see it says product added similarly let's add some other product and we'll go to the wishlist page there now let's go to this product name as belt within the product detail page now within the product detail page you can see the add to wishlist option we'll click and as you can see the option says the product is added now we will go to the wishlist page now within the wishlist page you can see it it says my wishlist that you can edit accordingly here from the back end i have uh, enabled some of the functionality that to be shown within the wishlist page like unit price and add to cart button by default to remove this particular product that option was already set up here you can also see that you can share your wishlist within some of the social network this is how wishlist plugin works thank you